an injection of All Blacks about to add some star power to an already tightly fought Bunnings NPC. County's Manuko get a massive boost as they front up to defending champions Waikato on a Friday night. Itini Nanai Situra was the man clearing it away. And the referee's playing advantage here. Offside, gold. La Lala with yeah. another carry. Well, they'll look to throw everything at them here. Little dummy from Roygaard. Try to slip through and get the ball away to Not Nanai Situru. Couldn't quite hook up with him, but they get the penalty. One this goal. one, well, he's in line with the left hand upright. First points of the game go to the home team, Counties Manuko. The top tackler so far in the NPC. They clear some ball up now for Mali Mali. He looks strong. He looks hungry for work. Leave him. And he looks dangerous. Flick pass away from Papali'i to Nipo Laulala. Now a little show of the ball and an offload nicely from Hohepa. And Slade struggling to get him to the ground. About 15 short of the goal line. This is a really good build-up. Can they finish it off? Fuliaki. Picked up quickly by Roy Gard. Snaps the pass away. And in at the corner. There's Tonya Tama. Well, that's a great build-up. Prolonged build-up from the Steelers. See the key turnover from the midfielder, Alatimu. That started it. Little pump fake. All too easy. Big man on little man. Try time. And now an opportunity to convert from wide out, and he struck it nicely too. That's a fine kick, and the Steelers lead it by 10 to nil. As you see the flat pass, and as KT said, he just hit it with pace. He gave no time for the defense to recover. Now Coombs Fabling slips the first tackle, gets past Dalton Papali'i as well. Just no one there to hook up with. Spills the ball, and Jorjepa has banged it away back downfield, all the way back to his own 22, goes Damian McKenzie. They're certainly looking dangerous out wide when they attack the fringes. Waikato. Here they come again. It's big semi-penny final. Dawai. Page made the tackle. Finau again. The two loose forwards combining to put him on the ground. Since the people starting to settle in their work here. Oh, Asu gets a nice pass away to Lachlan McQuaddle and the big lock is away for the try. Well, it was a lovely pass, but he still had a lot to do. You can hear the call. It's a great ball, ball in two hands, sucks in two defenders. And that is a beauty. Well, that's twice County's got stung. With the counter attack on the blind side from Waikato. Look at the long striding. Lachlan McQuannell. McKenzie with the conversion, and it's 10 7. Well, if you're pushing it into him, here it is. Roy Gard. Oh, some clever work there. It's inside. To scramble the ball away. But Waikato have got it back. McKenzie. Sees off the tackle of Papali'i, he'll enjoy that. Now Dawai. Pops the ball, nice ball back on the inside. Kearns Fabling frees it up. Jacobson stopped just five short of the line. McKenzie. Pops it up to McDonald and the referee's playing advantage. Roygaard. McKenzie, they've got them stretched here. Floats the pass, it's not a great pass. Mali Mali's there, but they'll come back for a penalty right out in front Offside. of the posts. Well, Sullivan was looking for the crossfield kick, and he Good was thing. preparing to chase it. McKenzie wearing a jersey, bearing the name of Waikato All Blacks. Two for County, sub. Has it been Set. All the backs lined away to the left. In it Hold goes. Nine. nine stay here. They start to edge forward. Advantage. Referee playing advantage. Roy Gard stopped just short. Satutu's there. Can't get the ball down. Still playing advantage. They go to the line. Oh, 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 oh. The replacement is over the line. And even from that range, 
advantage. No advantage. He can't award the try. They're going back for a penalty. See here, just grabs his shorts. It's a 2-2, two -two. Right. keeping it in, and then it was nearly a one-two punch from the two hookers. And again... Down. Let's use it. Stay here, back. Goes down, but the referee says, that's OK, you've got to use it. They swing it wide. Big test again of the Mulu defence. Guys, as a knock on in there, on. but that'll bring them to the end of the first half. half. So Waikato hold on. And at half time, in this round three match of the Bunnings NPC, Navigation Home Stadium in Pukekoi, it's all locked up 10 all between Counties Manuko and Waikato. Nanai Seturo just saw glimpses of him in the first half. Mali Mali made a strong start and uh, gets a nice ball away too. Little kick through from Nanai Seturo. Loose ball, McKenzie trying to dive on it. Ricocheting away, picked up. Oh, what brilliant skill by Hoskins Satutu. And Cameron Roygaard scores. See the little counter-attack. Mali Mali does a great job. Getting that ball away, and the little hint of a knock on there, but no, comes off his leg. And then fortunate bounce, and then inside ball to the ever present and exceptional Cam Roygaard. Oh, put this on the highlights reel. There's one offload, there's the tip back. A little bit fortunate here, but Satutu on the chase. Look at him, the recognition to go through three defenders, kick it, and look at that dish. How good is that? Nice and tasty for Roygaard. We're not out yeah. of it just John, yet. you got me there, mate. Saw a sharp line out from Waikato with Marshall on the field. So you'd have to bet with Luke Jacobson at halfback by the looks. It's going to be another maul. <laughs> Two locks, McConnell and Burt together, but they've gone right over the back. It's loose. Oh, it's picked up by Norris. the try, the line-out went all Look, we sweep wide. everything, I'm happy. An overthrow, but no luck in this, just desperation to win the small victories, and then all too easy for the big man. Heads-up play, though, was not a situation. We can see that he realises it's gone over, taps it over, and how good you... former New Zealand secondary sports schools uh, prop. Well, the line-outs have been a real dog's breakfast for tonight for both teams. First and now action is you're off your feet. Waikato will get a penalty. And, well, they've got an option here 19, to go for goal feet, and put themselves in front. <laughs> and not going to miss from that angle. And they go to the front. It's not a bad move. And the referee's playing advantage. He was collared high. So they can throw everything at Reese Marshall quickly off the line. But the referee, it's a penalty advantage. He was fine, but no advantage. Well, this one, handy enough to the posts. What do you do here? comes in and drills it between the uprights. That's a good kick under pressure. He was handy enough to the post, but believe me, that was not straightforward at all. Under! each other. Where's this one going? Oh, and straight into the hands. And it's going to be a try. It's a try. It could be a match winner too by Xavier Rowe. But the smarts of Reese Marshall showing once again, gets in between the defenders and finds the electric Xavier O. Well, how big has the bench been for Waikato tonight? Absolutely massive from Reese Marshall. We've already seen, already seen Ollie Norris get a score. And then Xavier Rowe, we know how good he is, he gets on the board. And he's judged it to perfection. That's a great kick from Damian McKenzie. 
But they're going to have to make every pass stick from here. Offer stepping. Oh, the ball's been pinched, though. Here's the chance now to put it beyond reach. Galway for the corner. He's in. Two leg tries have sealed it for the defending champions. Smart rugby put the ball in front of you and put it down their end. They get a turnover. That man Marshall again. The bench playing a massive role. And Dawai going over. Well, it's been the difference in this game for sure for Waikato. Those big boys coming on. Look at that. Comes, steals the ball, gets it out to the back. He knows where the support players are. Liam Mess and the experience well, just to get out of Waikato's finisher. Damien. Game over. Do you just want to check a potential knock on? Did yeah, Reese Marshall we'll have time for lose restart. possession? Well, this is huge because. If there is a knock on here, it means counties will get the ball. There will be time to play. Well, if it was onto his own foot, then potentially you'd say it's okay. But the fact that it's landed yeah. and it's travelled forward, it may be ruled out. Thank you. He's picked up a knock no on try. in there. Knock on. Oh, Have you the got a game. Mark? Yeah, this It's not decided play. yet. We'll play the scrum. Waikato claiming the ball had gone into touch. The referee says, play on. Well, they've gone 12 phases, but now the ball's been dropped. It's been towed through. Darwai's going to get his try after all. And that'll seal it. Well, he was denied moments ago. Well, it was on, wasn't it? It was just unfortunately just a bit of fatigue sitting in there. And this guy just so aware and puts an exclamation mark on a top performance here in Pukekohe. And it's the Mulus who overcome the Steelers. Waikato over County's Monaco, 34 points to 20.